Hey guys, how's it going? It's Olga, and today I wanted to give you a quick um, sort of uh, first impressions of a chemical peel that I had gotten um, online, and I finally tried it. So, um, the brand I used was Enchanted Waters, it looks like this, and I went ahead and got the glycolic acid peel in the 10%. Now, um, I know they have higher concentrations of it. Not sure quite what it goes up to. I know I watched another YouTuber do a 25% one. But um, on this um, seller's website on eBay, they did recommend if you've never never, sorry, <laughs> never done it before to go ahead and just start with the 10%. So I played it safe and I just started off with the 10%. And um, what I did first was um, wash my face completely and um, I used my little koja or con konjac sponge whatever you call those little things so I just kind of make sure I get all the makeup off and everything um then I did put um they say to put rubbing alcohol all over your face um I used a toner that had a lot of alcohol on it and pretty much soaked the sponge and just went over my whole face um and then let that dry and then I used gauze that I had gotten at the dollar store um you can also use this fan type of brush thing I guess but I just went with the gauze so it just looks like that and that's for individually wrapped so I'm just going to open one of these and then you put um, the product on it which comes this was around I want to say like 10 to 13 dollars so it wasn't very expensive at all I believe if you are going to go have it done at the salon um, it's over a hundred dollars I'm not a hundred percent unsure Ugh, cannot talk I'm sorry I'm not a hundred percent sure on that but it's quite expensive so at home is a lot cheaper um so anyway so i just um put some of this product on the gauze pretty much soaking through the gauze um i think i put a little bit too much on to be honest with you and then i went ahead and applied it um just being careful to avoid the eyes and the lips they said that any mucus membranes and um i actually um i thought i missed a few spots so i kind of applied some more um and also did my neck and then um i waited they say about i think on the bottle here it says one to four minutes on the other it came with it came in like a tube like this and it comes with these really nice instructions that are pretty detailed and that's um enchanted waters bath and spa i believe they have their own ebay store and you can purchase it on ebay um so here it says 1 to 10, here it said 1 to 4. I did about, oh, I don't know, probably, I got a little bit interrupted while I was waiting to wash it off, so I probably left it on a good 10 minutes, I'm not going to lie. Hopefully it won't be too much of an um, oopsie. But I figured it was only 10%, so it's not going to really um, do that much. Uh, some people talk about some kind of foaming, like where you get like a white film. I didn't get that at all. Um, it didn't burn excessively. I mean, it was a little bit, skin felt tightened and there was a little bit of a burn, but nothing too bad. Not where I'd like fan myself or anything like that. So, um, no irritation really, nothing like that. And, um, and then I went ahead and, um, when I brought it here, I had a spray bottle, um, that I filled with two tablespoons of baking soda and one cup of water and put it in a spray bottle. I think... That's more like for emergencies if you suddenly start to feel a lot of irritation in one area or if you get it in your eye or something. But um, I went ahead and kind of sprayed it on my face at the end of the time. Actually, first I washed my face because they said on, in here in the instructions to use copious amounts of water to get it off. So I did that and then I went in with a very gentle facial cleanser and then just to make sure... After that, I went in with uh, baking soda and the water. This just a spray bottle. Just a dollar store spray bottle, and I mixed in a cup of water and approximately two tablespoons. So this is what it looks like now. Um, it's um, obviously it's not peeling or anything yet. Um, it feels really clean, like it feels very deep cleaned. So that's good. But um, I will definitely follow up with you guys and see what happens in the next couple of days if anything um this is the lowest strength that they sell i believe so 
And you can apply this about once a week, I believe, but not to exceed twice a week. So I probably will do it maybe in a few days again. I don't know. I'll see how it goes with the peeling. Just because uh, it does say in here it takes six to eight times of use to see results. That's probably how much is in the bottle, too. About one ounce would be probably be about six uses or so. So, anyways, thanks for watching. Have a great day or night, wherever you are. And I will be checking back in with you in a few days. Or actually in a day. And then a couple more days. Alright? Thank you. Bye-bye now.